Hello everybody and welcome to another episode of Jurassic World Evolution. Yes, that's right, we're back here again despite all that we've been doing for Camp Cretaceous so far. But, in, if you recall in the last video, we worked on this area over here, like specifically... You see this line? Yeah, we did this side of it. Where we added the Edmontosaurus and Taurosaurus enclosure and the Stiggy Moloch and Homalocephalae. Which, that's probably my favorite, because I love seeing these guys next to their relatives. Um, for today's video, we're going to be working on this enclosure here, which, can't remember what I was going to do. Oh yeah, that's right, we're doing a platform here, and then we're also going to be starting over in this section, and then probably we won't get to this area, but we'll, we'll probably... We might start it, so first I'm going to build the enclosure around here, and then, well, let's first, we need to move this um, little piece somewhere, let's go here, and then if we go right there, there we go, that'll be much better, instead of the post being in our way, so let's get the let's get this to flatten and then we'll go as well let's flatten down here so we know what we're working with and then let's go come on okay this hopefully we can get a round area because uh, hopefully we can oh we could do a bigger let's just move this over here yeah we can do a round area right here um, I've got something for you if you're interested well I'm not so sorry um so let's get this right here. Well, no, let's um, move it to the middle right here because we need to make sure that we use all the space that we can, which we go here, and that's straight with each other, and then we can, we'll go straight, straight, and then here I think we can, no, we cannot go straight, so what we'll do is, well, actually, I know what we can do. Delete this, delete that, delete that, and we go straight, and here, and then we go onto this, and then we'll use this a little extension so it doesn't clip on the corner and then you go here and then what we do is line it try and line it up no no there we go and then we'll angle it well let's see we need to focus on this side more angle and then we can fill up this with path and do sort of like trees we'll do like trees or surrounding it Okay guys, so apparently we have a breakout of dinosaurs. Apparently the Taurosaurus are not happy. I think I I may have made a few too many um the what they're called Edmontosaurus, so we're in the middle of a situation. Assets are out of containment. 
I was not expecting that in my day. Oh, Jesus, everything's breaking up. Go, 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 go. I'll take over for you. Oh, come on. Seriously, drive, drive. Let's go. Oh, come on, Jesus. All right, so... Fence here. Or, and we'll put a fence here. What are you doing, you? All right, we'll take over. And let's try and stop from everything from getting out. So, da 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 da. And um, what are we? Since we're here right now, what do you guys think we? Stop doing that. I think I'm going to... What should we do in this enclosure for a dinosaur? I'm feeling we should do our first carnivore. Maybe something like Baryonyx, or... Or even, like, Spinosaurus. That would be a cool one. And diseases... Ah, oh, they're back. Who's sick? Okay, so... We'll send you... And we'll take over you. God, why is everything getting sick? And we need to t take away some of the, um, Edmontosaurus because apparently they are not happy with this. Well, not them, but, you know, the Taurosaurus are not happy. They feel crowded, which, at least they're, at least they're sharing what they feel. Wish they could have just left a note, it would have been easier. Alright, so, let's take one of you. We'll just take some basics, because there's a lot of them. Two. Where's the... Um... Ah, there's the tranquilized one. And we need to get those guys back in because the other Taurosaurus are going to be mad. Because you are so slow. We've got more diseases. We are not having a repeat of last time where, like, you guys failed miserably. It wasn't you. Okay, stay still, stay still, and boom. Come on. Got you. And he's all the way on the other side. Come on, go, 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 Amber. Oh, which one is it? Damn it, I missed all three of them. Nope, it's the... God damn it. Oi, Stiggy, I'm trying to help you guys. Duh, oh, run. Ow. Oh, it's a homeless... Ah, oh, there he is. Ah, oh, god damn it, now two of them. Turning. And come on, stay still. Bam! Got him. Oh God, Jesus! There we go. Crisis averted. Let get me out of here. Let's get out of here. And let's go and take a look at what we want in this enclosure. And while it's incubating, I'll fill in the path because I was rudely interrupted. Uh, let's see. We've... We've done th three of our dinosaurs that you need to unlock there, so we could just get our fourth one out of the way. Um... We could technically do Indominus, but we already did that on the other island as making it the star of that. We could do Metricanthosaurus because... Even though you have a mission with them on where to, uh, or I say we do Spinosaurus. Let's do Spinosaurus. Why not? 
but with skin. I do like jungle. Or we could do like a... A, a wetland, which is the black one, and a jungle one. Yeah, let's do that, and we'll get his lifespan up. And that'll help get his rating up a little bit. Well, no, we just want the bat. And in case he gets into a fight, let's give him two. Let's, no, 30. So then if we have the things on, and how much would another one be? Okay, yeah, we'll do two and then, so 60. He has a 3% chance of failing. No, let's just um, make sure that they don't fail. Get an up, no, this, success rate, and then we'll do two of them. One wetland and one jungle. A jungle. And we'll make this a nice wet and swampy enclosure. All right, so guys, the Spinosauruses are done, but first we need to um, get this ready. So let's just light tap this around. Not down there because we're gonna add the, um, like basically all of the weeds, well, plants, and a bit of dirt, a bit of dirt, taps. And then let's basically first we'll do it this way because it's easier. We'll just weed it all up. Well, you know what I mean. And um, I always like doing things like this with the um, feeders. If you want to make it look like they like were trapped in here, not because of the cage, even though they you can't get rid of the cage. Um, what you can do is, like, um, have it so that, like, the land's, like, built up here. So, like, there's a thin spot for water. So, like, the fish basically get stuck in here and, like, only a few at a time can go through. I always like doing that. just makes it look a little bit more, uh, alive, as you might say. And a little more. And grassland. And then we'll plant the um, scenery trees around and stuff. And this should count for our water. Like, I've had um, smaller enclosures with than this, and the water's been f fine for them. God, I really want to get the Sukumonis. Maybe in the f probably in the future I will get the um, deluxe DLC for this game. Maybe. Depends if I'm allowed to or not, because the one dinosaur in that that I really like is the um, Sukumimus, because it looks so, like, unique. Alright, so, don't want to delete all of them from the, from here, because it wouldn't make sense. Oh, oh no. I was like, they should be done already, but nope. We're back at, um... Basically five stars. We'll probably be at five stars with this. A contract just landed on my desk. You need to take a look. I'll I'll hold on to it. How many dinosaurs can Notosaurus have? So it can have up to seven dinosaurs, which isn't too bad. We just have one of these, and then like we could actually do them up here, because I need to also make a guest area and what I'm thinking is I'll do I said that I would do the hotel here so what I could do is do like a little like weird shape here line it up with path and then like have an enclosure here and then closure over here introducing the Spinosaurus and there goes the um cube so what a, what a traitor He's probably like, yeah, I'm not staying with that thing. No way. So evil.
Oh, I love the vibration of the um, gums. And he's annoyed with them. Well, guys, I'm sorry we can't keep him in that little box. I wanted to, tr I was, I tried, but you know, he's just not happy with it. We're gonna have to move him. So, what's your guys' favorite skin for the um, Spinosaurus? Mine's either, um, mine's either, um, the jungle or the, um, oh, I don't know actually what's my, like, my top three are, j besides the basic, is jungle, wetland, and the, um, vivid. Because, for one, I love the black on him. It, it really fits him. And with the light skin around. And then this one just looks that green on the the green on him. It's awesome. And then the vibrant. Like, I'm pretty sure a lot of people's going to say vibrant. But who knows. Leave in the comments what skin is your favorite. Besides the basic. Because personally I always like the basic for some of them. Except for the velociraptors. That's for sure. Um, so... Let's first get a hotel, and we can, p well first we should, I know it's not going to be proper, but we'll put a nice juicy power station, and that will cover where I'm going to build, so yeah, that's fine. And then we'll have a, oh yeah, and we're going to have a pathway here, so let's get the hotel. Ah, get out of the way. You're in the way. And we'll go here. And I guess we'll just put this beside it. And... Hey, you know I'm an entertainer first, but if you want to be famous, oh, wow, that was quick. you got to be successful. And how do we measure success? Money. That's how. All of you people just caring about the money. Okay, so we'll go here. Curve. No, that looks weird. That's way too long of a straight stretch. And then we'll curve you that way. And then we'll c curve a deeper curve. And then we'll go here and then that will be we'll curve there go around here let's go check on those guys because we do not want them to break out because that would be very dangerous uh, I'm going to say they shouldn't break out but I don't know. At least they're happy with what. So, you will be Papa Spino, and then you guys will get to name the dark one. Alright, so, let's um work on this area. So yeah, Notosaurus and some other creature will go in here. We could do a, like a small carnivore with them. I don't know. We'll, we'll find out. Um, and we'll just go straight. And we will put guess for oh, Jesus. Yes, fine. I thought of you. Oh, wow, we're really close. Um, we'll get guests. No, 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 not you. Let's get restaurant like we'll put two on each side and then a restroom on the end so restroom and then hopefully we can do nope nope we'll go here I was worried there for you came through for the entertainment division the oh I always do don't I and that is your doing. Oh. And 
No, no, we need a restaurant. Boom. And come on. Nope, we cannot fit. Okay, so what we'll do is we can straight we can straighten that out, so let's get to work on those notosaur that notosaurus. And I'll think of something that's going in with them. Hmm, let's do Let's do a woodland. And we'll need to def get them fully defense. And oh, you gotta be kidding me. Why can trees not fit there? Seriously? Trees can't fit? Like, seriously? A tree can fit here. Do, 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 do. And then if we go here... Nope, nothing. And we are back, guys. So I just um, finished, like, the guest area, and we are about to release the Notosaurus, and I think what we're going to do is probably just do a Pachycephalosaurus with them, because it's a small herbivore that doesn't like much population. So, we'll do them. <coughs> Jeep is trying to leave. So impolite. Oh, Security we got. There we go. We got the mission. My oh, apparently we did start the um five. The five star um thing. Just do a nice and rocky. Caps, and then we'll get the Pachycephalosaurus, and then that'll be the end of the episode. Oh, it's raining. And let's just get some... Tree 5... Let's see, how are you? Okay, you're perfectly fine with this enclosure. And let's get the Pachycephalosaurus incubated, so it's fine. Okay, so we can do horsetail and mosses. And that'll be good for both of them without harming either of them, so. We'll send you, because once you're done that, you can come all the way over here. a bit more rocky. <coughs> Let's 
So yeah, in the next video we're going to work on this, which hopefully because it's a bigger space I can do like the little cave system. If not, then I guess the only um, enclosure that's going to have a cave is going to be over here. Oh, are they all successful? Ah, damn it. One fa failed over here. Boom. Alright, so. Are four of them ready? Yeah, four of them are ready, so we can release them. And once they're done, guys, um. Well, that, I've said it already. It's gonna be the end of the video. So, introducing the Hachycephalosaurus. There he is, the Fire Tuck, Roland, and boom. I think you need to. And let's see. Okay, so release, release, release. Oh, damn it, he does on me. Alright, and fire. Got it. And, oh, let's get you all the way over here. Boom. And, let's go. Is the other one coming out? The other one is coming out, so let's get you before you go anywhere. Damn it. Don't run, don't run, don't run, don't run. Gotcha. And come on, hit him. Damn it. Come on, get him, get him, get him. He is down. And now we will get... We'll, the last one we'll put in probably off camera, guys, so... That's going to have to wrap up this video. If you've enjoyed it, leave a like. And if, if well, if you want to, you don't have to. Um, and if you want to join the hunt and help support this channel a little bit more, hit the subscribe button. Be safe. And until next time, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.